My mother worked in six inch heels. In fact, my mother made her own shoes because the shoes were not high enough for her. Amen. That was the mother that I had. She loved heels. And so therefore, me and my sister, we can walk in heels any day, any time. In fact, my younger sister, her own grace is very, very sufficient. So when they were walking in the station, a woman said, obviously my sister, in fact, that day, Toby wore her heels. And I said, ah, Toby, we're just going to touch to look and wear my heels. I said, ah, me too, I cannot carry last. Me too, I wear my heels. And so we went out and we walked together. And the man said, sorry, sorry, one second. It's been a while I've seen women walk so elegantly in heels. You guys are fantastic. What am I trying to say? We can both be wearing heels, but we don't walk the same. We can both know the Holy Ghost, but we don't use it the same way. We can both wear this boo-boo. It's not the same way to fit us. We can both cut this hair. It's not the same way. It's the same Holy Ghost, but it's to the extent that you use it that you have what you get. So decide today. This is not a joke matter. It's not a joke thing. Decide in your heart today that whatever you need must ha it must happen. It must happen. Something must change. Something must turn around. You are. I, I always say you were created on purpose for purpose. But as I was praying, the Holy Ghost said, mm -mm. "You were created on purpose for His." purpose you were created on purpose for his purpose there is a reason you are here it is for his glory the devil will try to distract you with things that you need and things are not happening yes but do not lose your sight on why you are here